Hi, I'm Matt Thompson. I'm an ophthalmologist at Tower Clock Eye Center. Today I want to spend a little time talking about a type of cornea transplant called a DMEC, which stands for a Decimase Membrane Endothelial Keratoplasty. This is a big complicated term to say a partial cornea transplant, where we are replacing just the inside layer of the cornea. To give a little historical perspective, cornea transplants have been around for over 100 years. They started out by replacing the entire cornea. We found that this surgery took a long time to recover from and gave good but not perfectly predictable results. A lot of patients have just one portion of their cornea that's not functioning properly. If you had a car with a flat tire, you wouldn't get a whole new car. You would replace the tire. So the same idea. We're going to replace the inside layer of the cornea that's not functioning properly to restore the vision. Over time, we've developed multiple different versions of these partial cornea transplants, and the current state-of-the-art technology in 2022 is a DMEC, Decimase Membrane Endothelial Keratoplasty. This is a very, very thin replacement transplant that's put on to the inside layer of the cornea. We're able to access the inside of the eye through a very tiny incision. The uh, incision is 2.2 millimeters in size. The donor cornea goes in through a tiny little injector, and then the surgeon unfolds it inside the eye. Uh, an air bubble is actually placed inside the eye in order to allow the surface tension of the air and the fluid inside the eye to um, stick the donor cornea into place against the patient's own cornea. And that cornea will attach itself over the course of a few days uh, and then clear up usually within a couple of months, allowing a much faster recovery than the old cornea transplants, which typically took a couple of years to recover. Uh, the results are very good. Uh, patients typically need eye drops to help the eye heal and to prevent rejection of the transplant, but almost always by six months, only one drop a day is needed.